Hello guys, a very warm welcome to my channel. It's Chuma here back with another video. It's a continuation from my demo on the Cream of Nature Apple Cider Vinegar Clarifying Rinse and the Brax Apple Cider Vinegar. I just wanted to do a separate video reviewing the two, the benefits of the two, pros and cons, and seeing which one came out just a little bit better in the end. And so if you want to be able to see what I think about the two products, then stick around. Here we go. So as you guys may or may not know, apple cider vinegar has got great benefits because of its amazing natural qualities. It's amazing for the body, it's definitely amazing for the hair, I've heard great things. So for the start of 2018, I wanted to jumpstart the year by cleansing my hair, giving it a fresh start, and what better way than using apple cider vinegar. But aside from just using the standard apple cider vinegar, as you guys know I do have the cream of nature one, I've had it for a while, it's just been sitting there. and since since I finally got to declutter and organize, you've seen that last video, right? It's right here. You've seen it, right? Since I managed to do that, I can definitely see everything. So I thought, right, there it is. It's right there. I might as well stop making great use of it. So I thought, let's do a comparison. What makes the apple cider vinegar clarifying rinse different from your standard apple cider, especially the Brax organic one? That's one that people live by, one that they've been using for quite a long time. So Cream of Nature just thought that they would switch it up and create something. I'm like, okay, let's see what the differences are there are definitely some great benefits in both pros and cons for both and I'll be able to let you guys know what I think about the two since I did the demo of course you guys have checked out the demo because that's the first thing you've seen this week and if you haven't seen the demo already guys the link is right above okay so I'm going to start with the Brax apple cider vinegar first this Brax apple cider vinegar is an organic raw unfiltered apple cider vinegar you definitely want to be able to get the unfiltered unfiltered version. It will say with the mother on it and it's unpasteurized. This means that you're getting the full nutritional value from the apple cider vinegar and that will definitely definitely benefit your natural hair. With the apple cider vinegar as you guys saw in my last video it did need to be diluted with water because it's very acidic so you want to be able to balance your pH and you don't want too much acid in your hair and that's the reason why I measured in my last video I diluted with water you can also apply oils if you wanted extra oils in there if you're gonna use it on its own with just water that's fine you can add other oils so your moisturizing oils castor oil olive oil coconut oil whatever oil you want to use you can do so I was watching a lot of videos and people were like oh my gosh the smell it's not it doesn't smell that great the smell the smell the smell I'm like but it just smells like vinegar <laughs> It's a potent smell, but that's vinegar. If you open any other type of vinegar, like malt vinegar or something like that, you'll get that little hint of smell. It doesn't stay for long as well. So where I'm watching videos and they're like, oh my gosh, the smell, it smells so horrible. Uh, I opened it and I was like, yeah, it's strong, but okay. Maybe it's because I grew up on a farm, innit? I'm used to these kind of smells, so. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> It didn't bother me much. It really, really did not bother me much in terms of the smell. So pros of the Bragg's apple cider vinegar is that it's as natural as it gets, guys. You've got all the natural qualities in there. If you want to be able to stay as organic and natural as possible with your natural hair journey, then using this as your natural shampoo every so often will definitely be able to help you along the way. Like I said before, just, just dilute it with water and you're good to go. As well as that, it's a nice big bottle. Look at that. Talk about value for money, guys. So I got this on Amazon because I wasn't going to be trying to look for it in this shop, in that shop, in that shop. It was £10, got it on Amazon, and it came prime, guys. It was available as a prime product. So ordered it. It came the next day. You guys saw my Instagram stories because you're following me, of course. And the fact that it's multi-purpose is another benefit because a lot of people on Instagram were like, oh, I use it. I drink it every day day because it's great for like your tummy if you want your stomach on flat flat hey, hey, on flat flat apparently that's supposed to work great for you so I was like ah, you mean okay 
there are a couple of holidays this year that we need to be on hand you know what I mean so yeah definitely going to be one that I'll be implementing on a daily basis in terms of drinking as well so it definitely has great health values in terms of your body and obviously as a great natural shampoo okay so some of the benefits of apple cider vinegar for natural hair is that it removes product buildup which is obviously like uh yes like we need that because if you're going to replace shampoo with something else and you want to be able to ensure that obviously it's removing the gunk out of your hair still still keeping your hair nice and clean before you go ahead and condition so removing product buildup is definitely key and it worked great for that i like it worked absolutely amazing for that it helps relieve dandruff and itchy scalp definitely know like if you are somebody who suffers from dandruff or has itchy scalps all the time then you you can give this a go as a cleanse and see how it works for you it is also known for balancing your hair's ph levels so if you want to be able to find out how it actually does that check out the description below because otherwise i'll waffle on a lot more than i need to in this video it definitely helps with hair loss and we know that i got that one bald spot the bald spot is covered but you know i got that one bald spot that i'm i'm still working on because i made that mistake in life so the start of 2018 i want to be able to start using products that would definitely benefit me and help me obviously grow my hair and finally it provides plenty of shine guys my hair was just shining 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 yeah <laughs> it really was just like bling 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 I was like mm, okay I like this shine thing and it also helps to detangle I detangled as normal when I put in the conditioner with my tangle teaser as you guys know I usually do but when I was styling I usually use a comb through and I didn't need to use that my hair was just like butter it was just like Ooh with this hair for example i just put it into twists after i rinsed the conditioner out and it just felt so nice my hair felt really really lovely so those are the pros i would say in terms of using your organic natural apple cider vinegar but yeah, so the cons i would say is just faffing about with measurements so it's just kind of like the making sure that you've got a right amount of apple cider vinegar to water to then be able to dilute if you're going to use oil in yours knowing how much oil that you need in that as well so that was a bit of a faff and then um having to obviously like you can't apply it like this having to get a spray bottle which of course i needed in my life because you know i've been talking about getting a spray bottle and i have the vernon francois spray and i said i was going to use that as my spray bottle once that finished but i have to wait for it to finish and i feel like this year with the way my hair is going i need a spray bottle in life like why is taking me so long so obviously i had to get one anyway but my point is if you didn't have one you didn't necessarily really need one then you're gonna have to go out and get a spray bottle just so that you can mix but I'm not gonna put the smell as a con because for me it's just vinegar like it's not unbearable it just smells like vinegar so I it's not a con to me in terms of that I definitely liked it it was a thumbs up and let's see how it fared with the cream of nature apple cider vinegar clarifying rinse okay so with the cream of nature this is the argan oil range so the cream of nature with argan oil from morocco for natural hair apple cider vinegar clarifying rinse they've helped me out guys and actually given me what it does on the tin so i'm gonna give you that information so this reduces product buildup which i've mentioned before in terms of your box standard what apple cider vinegar is going to do for your natural hair it seals the cuticle it helps protect the natural ph of your hair and that's what I've mentioned again it refreshes the scalp also touched on that this is definitely free from sulfate silicone petroleum material or material oil yeah I can't read mineral oil Jeez. it has no alcohol and you don't need to mix it you don't need to mix it with anything whatsoever and then because it is mixed with argan oil this unique deep cleansing rinse combines argan oil from Morocco and apple cider vinegar to gently remove product buildup without stripping moisture from hair. This clarifying rinse helps protect hair's natural HP balance, pH, HP. I'm not thinking about sauce. This clarifying rinse helps protect hair's natural pH balance, which is essential to make hair smoother, softer, with incredible shine. It also reduces frizz. Adds exotic shine, helps protect against breakage, which is absolutely great. All you have to do with this, as you saw in the demo, is like you wet your hair, you apply it, wait three minutes, and then you're good to go. Pros and cons. Obviously, those are all the pros that I've just read out in terms of great advantage for the hair. All of that good stuff. In terms of the 
the cons is that you've got extra added stuff in the product so you've got your ingredients starting off with water you've got castor oil in there you've got glycerin you've got fragrance and you've of course got the vinegar and some other chemical stuff which i'm sure are absolutely fine for your natural hair but if you're somebody who wants to be on like the organic natural hair journey route of just using everything natural then it's not going to be that beneficial so i put i would put that in as a con in terms of the amount of ingredients ingredients that it has in it as opposed to you just adding the apple cider vinegar and water um, another con and it's a very very small con this is me nitpicking in terms of a con is that the lid it's great in terms of application it's like a nice small hole but where I was used to the spray bottle because of the apple cider vinegar the natural apple cider vinegar it was actually nice to spray on my hair directly so I found with this because it's great for the scalp you can apply it quite easily on the scalp but to actually get to remove the product build up on your actual hair you kind of have to faff with it a bit and it's not as straightforward I mean I'm nitpicking but I would say that's another con in terms of that okay guys so my conclusion is that it is a draw between the two I really couldn't see the distinct difference between one or the other in terms of my hair they both removed my product builder both gave me exactly what they said on the tin obviously one is derived from the other so you can't really be like oh they're completely different if you are somebody who is on the go who wanted more than just apple cider vinegar and wanted more of the benefits of cream of nature with alcohol oil from Morocco range then you would go for it you would you would do what you need to do it's nice and simple to use you're rinsing after three minutes so it's nice and simple whereas the apple cider vinegar if it's natural you kind of have to put in and be shaken and you're sitting for about 10 to 15 minutes before you remove it it depends on your lifestyle it depends on you know how you want to move forward with your natural hair and what you want to do as to you know which one you want to get one is more affordable than the other I think the cream of nature comes up just under the full bottle of the apple cider vin vinegar but again this is multi-purpose you can use it for more than one thing and it will serve you well so <laughs> which one will I be using moving forward I think it's more cost effective to use the Brax apple cider vinegar I don't mind having to mix I don't mind the smell at all so I definitely will be using this moving forward because I know I will be using it for other things I will of course be finishing the cream of nature apple cider vinegar clarifying rinse so I will continue to use it until it finishes but I don't think I would purchase it again well I didn't purchase it the first time but I don't think I would purchase it moving forward but of course you already know like this is family so all the other products from this range specifically need to be restocked because I've literally run out I have nothing maybe one or two things but aside from that I have nothing <laughs> okay guys and that is it for me in terms of reviewing the cream of nature with argan oil from Morocco for natural hair apple cider vinegar clarifying rinse and the Bragg's organic apple cider vinegar I hope you guys have enjoyed this video of course if you're joining me for the very first time welcome on board be sure to subscribe below so that you never miss a beat and also be part of the auto notification crew you know what I mean you guys to just be part of the team baby you gotta be part of the team so go ahead and subscribe if you're returning a very warm welcome thank you for returning all right this twist out will follow in the next video i hope you guys have enjoyed this one thank you so much for watching i appreciate you guys i love you and until next time bye